at every life that he has lived on this planet, even as a single cell with detail. So when I say there is no reincarnation, they said, yes, it is. So, uh, and then there are people present now as gurus that when they got enlightened, they talk about all the past life. And then they say the way they see it since they got enlightened because of the karma they have, they said, no, they don't accumulate any action anymore. Because at the time of death, they're not going to die. They leave their body because they don't want to come back. But then uh, you say we don't come back. We only have one life. So how do we... Uh, how do we humans, how do we... humans have one life because we've chosen that way. If you choose a cycle of life, which is to achieve a target, you can change different clothes. You don't change as a person just because you put different clothes on. It's still the same man inside. But with us, that inside is the soul. Doesn't matter what frog we put on. I was explaining this to a knowledge seekers a few weeks, few months ago. I can tell you exactly, precisely where there is even today an oasis. One tree one water well, and I stayed there for decades, till the time was right. I explained this to the knowledge seeker. I remember clearly the whole stages of the life, existence of the life, because we are present as a soul, not in the dimension. We choose the dimension of physicality to be present or not. But man chooses one physical life and he carries on because it comes from an amalgamation of physicality to soul. We come from the soul to physicality. It's a totally different position. And this is what I said, the new life on earth to come is created out of the soul, interaction of the souls and not physicality. This is why I said many times, I even remember the hammer of the nail in the palm of the hand. We chose, mankind changes clothing. We change the clothing of the physicality of the man, which is a big difference. Then we, we don't need to remember, because it's part of the process of the soul. It is in memory bank, it's in RNA. And many people I've spoken to, I can tell you, they just talk because they're read, because they don't understand. This is just a fake talk. Because we see the soul. We I'm walk. You, you change clothes, we change bodies. But it's the same soul. Be it the soul of the Christ, be it the soul of Moses, be it the soul of Muhammad, that's his name, and everybody else. And there is a big difference when you come from the soul, you change the physicality, or your physicality, you change your course, because you have no control over it. You just let the bread free now to go and learn. Where we have learned, we come to show. And it's a big difference. Thank you, Mr. Keshe. Mr. Keshe, also you said uh, you, uh, you came from planet Zeus and you're not from here. So my question is, how, how, if, if there are other people who are not from here, but they live in this planet, but how did you show up in your mother's womb? I mean, how, how, how did that we, happen? We take the body of the man. We don't take the process of life of the birth of the man. It's totally different. If but I you... tell you, if I tell you the planet Zeus is the creator, what, how would you go? You go crazy. So you're happy with the planet Zeus, so we play with planet Zeus. The understanding is according to the intelligence. The the process of creation has a, a physical dimension or a soul dimension. 
you can create through the soul. Then the physicality can be any, or you go the way the physical dimension goes, you create this physicality to do, create the soul, and then that soul needs its freedom to take new dimension. But, uh, we come a different way. We come through the soul. And that's why I start teaching that the new generation of man will create the soul first, and then through it the physicality decides. Because the new generation can live anywhere in the universe because it changes just the clothes. But the soul in essence is the same. But when you are created out of the soul, you carry the knowledge of the universe. Because when the soul is created, all the fields of the creation will come together to create that soul. We are about to witness the birth of the first